Hello and welcome by a video tutorial of Magento Commerce. My name is Ray Bachman from Girio and with this tutorial I will show you how to compress your website and increase speed with a Magento website using Mod Deflate. Well what what is Mod Deflate? Mod Deflate is a compression tool within Apache and we'll show you a website right here where the summary explains it. So the output of the website is compressed and sent uh, to the browser so the speed is increased within your website. Default within Magento it's not uh, set right. So what we're going to do is I'm going to show you how to set it right and how to configure it. But first of all we need to check if the server uh, which is uh, Magento running on is compatible for uh, mod deflate. Before we do that we need to uh, create a file uh, within our website and uh, see if mod deflate is available but before we do that I'm going to show you uh, I got a demo website right here uh, and with this demo website I'm going to uh, explain to you that the mod deflate configuration is not set right yet so I'm going uh, to copy my URL and go to the website what is my IP, uh, .org, uh, slash http uh, compress compression so I'm gonna copy it right here press test and then the website will show us that this URL is not gzipped so uh, potentially we could save a lot of uh, um, speed within our website so what I've done is uh, I'm using a, or an FTP or a SSH connection and uh, what I've done is I've created a, a file uh, php info.php and within this file this is the only content within it um, and let's find out if I'm gonna uh, retrieve this file from our browser and as you can see when I search for the word deflate that the load modules on the server is available so my deflate is uh, situated right here and over here we see that gzip and deflate is a uh, correct install so uh, that's a big benefit from from this point of view so let's see how we're going to configure it with magento for increasing speed um, and the only thing we have to uh, configure is the dot uh, .hexs file which is uh, also situated in the configuration of our directory uh, i'm using um, uh, SSH right now so we can see uh, what's going on with it and uh, let's see I'm gonna open the dot HS file and we can see around here if you search for uh, the mod deflate uh, configuration that uh, uh, the, the the module is only loaded if the module is uh, um, installed correctly on the server and from this point you can see that the configuration is all configured uh, um, uh, with a hash so that means that it's not running yet so what we have to do is we have to remove the hashes uh, for uh, the output configuration which uh, is needed for our Magento installation but be aware that not all servers are configured directly so um, we have to see what's going on with that but what I've done is I've created a, a, a file uh, which most of the time uh, works directly if my deflate works and I have copied that on an old HTTP file and as you can see right here the module um, and also the comment uh, I filtered out uh, is it, it's more or less the same but there are some strings are uh, added to this uh, like uh, like this one is extra and this one is also extra and we uh, cor uh, corrected the, the download uh, zip error within Magento so if you have a download section within your uh, web shop running and you have uh, zip or gz fi uh, files uh, uh, which is uh, downloaded by your customers then that probably is going to be an error but with this uh, configuration uh, no error will uh, occur so what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy this uh, Mm. And let's go back to the other file what I'm gonna do then is I'm gonna delete the section over here this may be much easier copy the content
uh, that looks more like it. I'm going to save the file, head back over to the uh, whatismyip.org website. I'm going to run the test again and let's see what is happening. And it takes a little while and as you can see right here everything has occurred and we had a data saving of almost 76 percent so uh, that's a big increase uh, I would say uh, so from this point uh, it's really easy to uh, have the, the website from Magento running uh, at least much faster than in the beginning if you want to read uh, the, the, the text tutorial on our Jiria.com uh, tutorials uh, area uh, we've got a, a text tutorial of compressing Magento output and with all the configurations within it and you can copy and paste uh, the sections over here and use it within your own configuration well this was a video from Jirio uh, visit our website at Jirio.com for more tutorials uh, have a fun way creating more webshops with uh, Magento until next time.